Bruce Lee, a name that reverberates through the annals of martial arts history, remains an icon of physical prowess, mental discipline, and cinematic brilliance. His life was a testament to the power of ambition, determination, and unparalleled skill. Yet, beneath the surface of his fame and success lay a story tinged with tragedy, a narrative marked by struggle, discrimination, and premature death. This biography delves into the intricate layers of Bruce Lee's life, exploring the triumphs and tribulations that shaped the legend we remember today. Early Life and Influences Born on November 27, 1940, in San Francisco's Chinatown, Bruce Lee emerged into a world fraught with racial tension and prejudice. His father, Li Hoi Chin, was a Cantonese opera star, and his mother, Grace Ho, hailed from a prosperous Hong Kong family. From a young age, Bruce Lee was exposed to the performing arts and martial traditions, as his father introduced him to the world of Chinese opera and kung fu. However, Lee's upbringing was not without its challenges. Growing up in Hong Kong during a time of political turmoil and social upheaval, he faced discrimination as a Eurasian child. Bullied and marginalized, he found solace and empowerment in the practice of Wing Chun, a traditional form of Southern Chinese martial arts. Under the tutelage of Ip Man, a renowned Wing Chun master, Lee honed his skills and developed a philosophy that would shape his approach to combat and life itself. Rise to Prominence In 1959, Bruce Lee returned to the United States, determined to pursue his dreams and carve a niche for himself in the world of martial arts. Settling in Seattle, he enrolled at the University of Washington, where he studied philosophy and continued to refine his martial arts expertise. It was during this time that Lee began to attract attention for his unparalleled speed, agility, and charisma. In 1964, Bruce Lee caught the eye of television producers with his electrifying demonstration at the Long Beach International Karate Championships. His dynamic performance led to a series of guest appearances on popular shows such as The Green Hornet and Batman, where he showcased his martial prowess to a global audience. With his magnetic presence and unparalleled skill, Lee quickly became a cultural phenomenon, breaking down barriers and challenging stereotypes along the way. Cinematic Legacy While Bruce Lee achieved fame and recognition through his television appearances, it was his groundbreaking film career that cemented his status as a cultural icon. In 1971, Lee starred in The Big Boss, his first leading role in a feature film. The movie's success catapulted him to international stardom, establishing him as a bona fide action star and martial arts legend. Subsequent films such as Fist of Fury and Way of the Dragon further solidified Lee's reputation as a cinematic trailblazer, as he defied conventions and shattered box office records with his electrifying performances. However, it was his magnum opus, Enter the Dragon, released in 1973, that would etch his name into the annals of film history. Tragically, Lee would not live to witness the full extent of his cinematic legacy, as he passed away just days before the film's premiere. Personal Struggles and Demons Behind the facade of fame and success, Bruce Lee grappled with a myriad of personal demons and existential questions. His relentless pursuit of perfection often led him down a path of self-doubt and introspection, as he struggled to reconcile his public persona with his private insecurities. Additionally, Lee faced scrutiny and criticism from both Western and Eastern audiences, who struggled to accept a Chinese martial artist as a global superstar. Moreover, Lee's unorthodox philosophy and outspoken demeanor alienated him from traditional martial arts communities, leading to friction and animosity within the martial arts world. Despite his best efforts to bridge the gap between East and West, Lee found himself caught in a cultural limbo, a man without a country, torn between conflicting identities and allegiances. Legacy and Cultural Impact Despite his untimely death at the age of 32, Bruce Lee's legacy endures as a testament to the power of the human spirit and the pursuit of excellence. His influence transcends the realms of martial arts and cinema, permeating popular culture and inspiring generations of artists, athletes, and thinkers. From Jackie Chan to Quentin Tarantino, Bruce Lee's imprint can be felt in the works of countless individuals who have been touched by his indomitable spirit and unmatched charisma. Moreover, his philosophy of self-expression and personal liberation continues to resonate with audiences around the world. 
serving as a beacon of hope and inspiration in an increasingly turbulent world. In the final analysis, Bruce Lee's life is a tragic tale of triumph and adversity, a story of a man who defied the odds and transcended the limitations imposed upon him by society. From his humble beginnings in San Francisco's Chinatown to his meteoric rise to fame on the silver screen, Lee's journey embodies the resilience of the human spirit and the enduring power of the individual to effect change. Though he may have been taken from us too soon, Bruce Lee's legacy lives on. A testament to the transformative power of martial arts, the enduring allure of cinema, and the timeless quest for self-discovery. In death, as in life, Bruce Lee remains an immortal legend, a symbol of strength, courage, and unwavering determination in the face of adversity.